Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us continue with the next question. That is a GATE CSE 2006 question 71. Okay, yes. So the question is, an array x of n distinct integers is interpreted as a complete binary tree. Okay, so the index of the first element of the array is 0. Okay, so the index of a parent of x of i is equal to question mark. Okay, okay, so this question seems to be really interesting, right? So we normally know how a complete binary tree is stored. Okay. So let me draw a normal complete binary tree. D, E. So this is a complete binary tree. So in array representation, how it will be stored, guys? Okay. So here you will be having A, B, C, D, E. So in the exact order you will store. But the only catch is, so whenever you are storing it in array, we will start index from 1, right, to reduce confusion. Sir. But here he is forcing us to start from 0. Okay. So, if we are starting from 0, so the question is the index of a parent of x of i. So, basically, if I, if someone asks you what is the address or what is the location of d's parent, how you will be finding. So, basically, where is d's parent, guys? d's value is a 3. So, value of d is a 3. And d's parent is at 1. Okay. So, you need to get the answer 1. So, if you substitute i equal to 3, you should get a 1. So, let us start substituting in the values, guys. Okay. So, first option is i by 2. So, remember one more thing. So, these brackets are a bit different, right? So, they did not write draw in this way, right? Yes. So, that's a, these are different type of brackets, guys. So, the first bracket is, this bracket is called as a seal value. S-E-A-L. Okay. And the, bo okay, sorry. So, seal, okay. And the bottom one is called as a floor. Okay, so the simple trick to remember is, uh, so where will be our ceiling fans guys, uh, so they will be above us, right, so that is the reason why it will be above us, where is our floor like tiles and all those things at the floor bottom, so in that way, okay, and the values, uh, if you have 9.9 .9 in seal value, it will give the answer as 10, so it will take the maximum value, so even if you give 9.1 seal value, what it will give, it will give 10 guys, so if you take floor value, of 9.9 .9, it will give 9 similarly floor value of 9.1 will also give 9 so this is the concept which you should have an idea before solving this question guys okay prerequisite you can say okay yes so now you are clear with seal and floor values right so let us substitute our answers our values into the question okay yes so 3 by 2 okay so 3 by 2 is what is the value guys it is 1.5 okay and what is the lower bound that is nothing but floor value it is 1 so option 1 is still in the race okay moving on to option 2 that is nothing but 3 minus 1 that is nothing but 2 by 2 that is 1 so option 2 is also in the race wow moving on to option c it is 1 by 2 with the upper value so if it is upper value if it if we turn 1.2 it will say 2 but our required answer is 1 so hence option c is wrong guys okay similarly moving on to option d Okay, so if you take seal value of i by 2, it is nothing but 1.5 minus 1 seal value. So it is nothing but 0.5 seal value, which is nothing but 1. So again, for this is also satisfying. Okay, so our 3, for 3, we got the correct answer. So let us take for 4, guys. So we are having 4th element. So for that also, you should get the answer as 1. So let us substitute. So we are having only 3 options now. For A, we are having, B, we are having, and D, we are having. So let us substitute. 4. So 4 by 2 lower value okay so what we are getting we are getting two but our answer is one guys so hence option a is also wrong got it yes so moving on to option b which is nothing but i minus one which will return three by two with upper bound okay so three by two is nothing but 1.5 with the seal value okay so again you are getting two hence option b is also wrong guys so now you are getting an idea, right? So how I am exactly solving? So now let us go through option D. That is nothing but firstly we are doing i by 2. Means 4 by 2 you will get a 2 minus 1 seal value. So you will be getting 1. So this answer is matching. Hence you can say that option A, B, C are wrong and D is the correct answer. Okay. So now you got an idea, right? So how exactly to solve the question? So take an example, test the values, slowly eliminate the options. So at the end you will be left out with one option. So basically these questions will take two to three minutes maximum guys. If you concentrate, okay? Yes. And this is a two mark question. So it's a good mark, right? Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on this. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question guys. Okay? Yes. So let us meet in the next lecture. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.